Hello everyone. So now I'm going to discuss the topic 5, function and graph. Number 1. Is the function 1 to 1 or not? If your answer is yes, then there is an inverse function for that situation. There are two methods to determine whether the function is 1 to 1 or not. A. Algebraic methods. A function f is said to be 1 to 1 if fx sub 1 equals to fx sub 2. And it implies that the x sub 1 equals to x sub 2. Method number 2. Horizontal line test. We can also use the graphical method to test whether a function is 1 to 1 or not by using a line that is parallel to the x-axis or we can say a horizontal line test. It at most cut the graph at only one point then the function is says to be 1 to 1. I repeat, cut the graph at only one point then the function is says to be 1 to 1 function. Here the example show that whether the following function are one to one or not. So given the first situation is a constant. For the question A, given the function fx is equal to 8. So in order to show that whether the function is one to one or not, fx sub 1 is equal to fx sub 2. So as we all know, for the left hand side, for fx sub 1 is equal to 8. For the right hand side, fx sub 2 is equal to 8 as well. So for this case, x sub 1 is not equal to x sub 2. So as a conclusion, for the function fx is equal to 8, is not a 1 to 1 function. So as a conclusion, f inverse does not exist for this situation. So now I'm going to use the graphical method to determine whether the following function is 1 to 1 or not. So given we have fx is equal to 8, as we all know, fx actually is equal to y. So here we have y equals to 8, which is a horizontal line. So now I'm going to illustrate the situation. Then we have to name it fx is equal to since we are using the graphical method, so we need to draw a line that is parallel to the x-axis, so which is a, another horizontal line. So the horizontal line for the test, I'm going to uh, illustrate it with a red color. So as we can see, the red color totally cover the blue color, so meaning that there is an intersection. So for the conclusion, fx equals to 8 is not a 1 to 1 function. Why? Because it cuts more than one point. So here we are and Thanks for watching.